welcome to another FAQ Monday. I'm your host, Fluff, and you know what? Today, we are gonna talk about... Nothing. We're not gonna talk about anything. You know what? That doesn't even matter what uh, what that was. First question! What are your thoughts on Ormsby guitars? Any plans to demo models in the future? The homie Jared Dines has a couple of them, most notably the 18-string guitar that I see every time I go to Rest Repose rehearsal. Uh, they're cool guitars. I played a couple of them. They're great. I'm not really a seven string player though. And I think they primarily make seven strings if I'm not mistaken, I'm probably mistaken. But um, they're awesome guitars. Their NAM booth was awesome and uh, they're good people, but uh, I have never demoed them on this channel. Definitely would like to, but uh, yeah, they're really, really nice guitars. Have you ever thought about putting in some Fishman pickups on that PRS guitar of yours? Actually, no. One of the main reasons I wanted to get the PRS and to uh, another degree, the Bernie, is because I wanted a more diverse slice of guitars for various kinds of demos. For example, the PRS is really, really pedal friendly. So I use that most of the time when I'm demoing pedals as opposed to some super modded, high gain, active pickup. The PRS is just a real middle of the road rock guitar. And that's exactly what I was looking for. Also, the same goes for the Bernie Les Paul. I just, you know, I want diversity in the studio depending on what I am recording for or playing, etc., etc. So, no, I have no plans to change anything on the PRS. It will remain stock until I'm dead. What drum samples did you use on the Rest Repose full length? Okay, so the Rest Repose full length was all stock Easy Drummer 2 modern kit with the exception of the snare. And I believe the snare is a Ludwig Supraphonic snare from the Metal Machine pack, if I am not mistaken. It's been a hot second since I have uh, opened that kit up because I use Superior Armor 3 now, but that was what I ran with all of my stuff for a really long time. It just sounded so good. That was stock easy drummer for the most part though. Pretty cool. Why don't you have a line of coffee themed fluff pedals? I, uh, I, I mean, yeah, why don't I? It's pretty good. Hmm. And now Fluff reads a tweet. Watching Dumb and Dumber for the first time in 15 years, still absolute comedic gold. And it is. My suggestion to you this week is to check out the new Muse album, Simulation Theory. Uh, this album is, I mean, it's Muse. What are you gonna say? It's awesome. It's a big retro themed rock record. And I've been listening to it a lot while driving. It's awesome. It's catchy. I'm humming the songs when I'm, um, you know, letting the dogs out in the morning or making coffee. It's just, it's really catchy and it'll get you. And it'll get you good. All the pickable links down below in the description. You've been wonderful, I've been Fluff. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you next time.